Hey guys, so welcome no. back to vlog 2 on the same day. So, right now, me and my partner, where are we going? To an Italian. Can you speak loud? No. <laughs> to an Italian restaurant. Named? Officina Zero Zero. Why Zero Zero? Uh, oh, oh, I don't know. I think it's Zero Zero. But why Zero Zero? Is there a significance? I have no idea. I don't know. I've never been to this place before. Right, so we are going to Officina 00. Um, essentially, we were thinking of eat, like we're contemplating what to eat, and we figured that we can eat Italian food. Mm -hmm. And we have like a saved bunch of restaurants um, that we like want to go to, mm -hmm. and we have like a common list on Instagram for that. And um, we thought since we're in central London, we figured out which is like a close restaurant to us. And we chose Two, four, three. three. So we're going to go to Officina, guys. Right? Yep. We're on the bus. Their menu is good. Apparently, it's cheaper. I've not seen the menu. She knows everything and she wants to try a lot of things. <laughs> So let's see guys, so let's see how it is. Alright guys, so we have finally reached the restaurant Officina 00. zero. Bonna Serata, Ciao, everything. Um, we have gotten like a window um, counter where we can see amazing views of like what we can see. What do you mean? San Thank Sebastian. You. Something bus to center. Center? Something bus to center. No, no, the no, no, not bus. Like, I mean, what views can you see? There's just cars and a lonely co-op and some signals. Um, so yeah. Um, <laughs> but we got like a window table. It's quite a like cozy, nice uh, thing that they have going on. Um, and this is our table and high chairs and that's the menu uh we'll show you all shortly what all you're gonna order guys let's see if the food is up to mark up to the mark that an italian actually likes it. right so we have finally placed the order and one italian to one, another italian there was some secret conversation about apparently parmesan cheese being vegetarian and non-vegetarian that was going on not to me, to them. Essentially, to make parmesan cheese, <laughs> they use something that's called caglio. I don't know the Calio. name. Calio. Calio. I don't know the name in English. But essentially, it's like a enzyme or something that's taken from the sheep's stomach. What? No, no I don't want to know, guys. It's so fine. technically, we, 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 parmesan but... cheese is not vegetarian as such because they use this thing to make it. Fine. Either way. What is the order? So we got some bread, we got some fried ravioli, which is a type of like stuffed pasta. We got some like, I'm guessing this Banco is going to be like breaded or fried lasagna, which obviously is a bit different than usual. We got parmigiana, which is the aubergine and cheese layered with the tomato, all of that. And then we got a kind of pasta. I actually am not familiar with this shape, but I'm guessing it's a type of pasta uh, with mushrooms. With a mushroom sauce. So let's see, and then we got a glass of wine. What are you most excited about from the menu? Uh, I think the mushroom pasta. Let's see if it lives up to the standards, guys. We have got the first starter, which is the sardo bread. And what is this? You said butter, cheese. It's butter, isn't it? I think it might be butter. I tried it, but I don't know. Anyway, no, I'm not gonna try. I'm just gonna have the bread, but it looks nice, no? But I thought you like focaccia, so why did we get this? Yeah, but she said that this kind of bread is better for the sardo we got, so... Fine guys, so this is it. We are gonna eat the sardo bread instead of the focaccia. And now we have the what? This is what? Ravioli fritta. Ravioli fritta. Ravioli fritte. So what if I cut it open? Can I cut it open? I'm guessing it would be like eating inside. Not the thick, like soft. Oh. It's like cheese, huh? Yeah. Can you taste it? Ravioli fritta. So guys, the first dish, which was a ravioli fritta, has been approved by the authentic Italian. It's going good so far. Hopefully the dishes to come will also be liked by this Italian here. Very high standards, guys. Good job. 
Officino. The second dish is on the table, guys. High expectations and hopes. It's called fried lasagna with some whatever she said. Garlic, tuttu, avioli, pattu. What's that? What did she say, Kendra? Me. Garlic, avioli, sauce. Hmm. Come. Forget about that. Forget about whatever is in your mouth. Come on. Come on, lasagna. Come on, lasagna. You got this. It's well, it's well made. It's well cooked. Medium rare. Do you reckon I should try this sauce? Yes. Because the people are master chef. Oh, 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 oh. wow. Mmm. Mm. Oh, mm. Guys, approved. Second dish also approved, guys. Lovely. We are happy with this. All right, guys. The third dish is here. Again, from the first two dishes. We have very very high expectations now. This is the lasagna, lasagna fatto, parmigiana or bijana. Ah, this is the parmigiana or bijana. Let's see, guys. I'm rooting for this. Let's see. So it's essentially eggplant. Eggplant, brinjal. Oh no, the no, the face doesn't look like it's impressed. It's good, but it's not as special as the other dishes. Can I say it's good? Yeah, fair enough. And so, how would you rate it on a scale of one to ten? With ten being the best possible food. <laughs> ten being the best possible. Yeah. Seven. Seven. Fair enough, guys. We have one more dish coming after this. Hopefully, that enlightens our brain. Guys. So, this is the last. Dish like the last ever dish. I mean, <laughs> in this restaurant right now, the ramisu. We were actually going for the cannoli, but guys, did you all know cannoli has pig fat? It's made in pig fat, guys. I don't think that's correct. <coughs> I think probably most places don't use that anymore these days. I don't know. By the way, we were supposed to get the cannoli, but because it's made in pig fat, we went for the tiramisu and. I mean, till now the food has been amazing. I hope the tiramisu is also really good. So let's see. Not a new boss this time. No, no, no. Because you are the Italian boss. Yes. The biscuit is a bit hard. Come on, babe. I'm running out of battery. It's we don't have till tomorrow. It's hard. They said it's crunchy, didn't they? Nah. It's good. Approved, guys. I think that would be it for my today's video. Uh, we have really enjoyed the food. Have had a fun day. And again, we would highly recommend if you like Italian food, coming to Officino. It's in Oldwood, and there's one in Fitzrovia, I think. But I'm not sure about price or no. But it's really good, guys. I'm gonna end the vlog here. So if you like the video, like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next vlog. Bye.